There is nothing more beautiful than someone who goes out of her way to make life beautiful for others. A very good evening and welcome to our personality program, Heartland Stars. Pharmacist Dumebi Nadumije is our Heartland Star who think of giving not as a duty but as a privilege. Stay with us as we showcase this beautiful star who believe in making life more enjoyable for others. My name is Asamta Obidaso. Don't go away. He who wished to secure the good of others has already secured his own. We made a living by what we get, but we make a life by what we give. Pharmacist Dimebi Lone Nadumije, a philanthropist of high repute, was born into a noble family of renowned and famous industrialists, led Dr. Nadumije Christian Igwe and led Honorable Barrister Yudara Obigeli Igwe Okwasileze, an astute politician and an acclaimed philanthropist. I came to this world and found myself in a problem I never forget, not by desire, not by choice. So that we choose to be disabled, sister, disabled is this not a cause. Disabled is this not a cause. Disabled is this not a cause. So disabled. Just like her parents, who were well read, Leone Nadumijo started her journey into education with Goshen Nazri and Primary School over Imo State. She graduated as one of the best pupils, and that automatically guaranteed her a clear pass to one of the most prestigious and adorable girls' college in Nigeria, Federal Government Girls' College, Owe. With the dream of being a pharmacist, Dimebi Nadimije gained admission to study pharmacy in one of the best private university, Madonna University, LL, River State, Nigeria where she excelled beyond the admiration of others. Her quest for education and love for pharmacy took her to Tenapion Medical University, Ukraine, in Europe, where she studied pharmacy to master's level. The nobility of her background paved way for pharmacist Dimebi Nodunijia's passion in humanitarian service to the society through her non-governmental organization, Udara Obigiri Foundation. This foundation has touched so many lives through their empowerment programs and generosity arts. Are you here? He will say to him, ma, ma, do, say to him, ma. Ma, do, say to him, ma. Oh, yeah, 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 This woman is very beautiful. Let me hug you. Come on, my mama, dad. You're a shark. You, 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 you,
Dimobi believes that kindness is the language which the deaf can hear and the blind can see. As such, she deemed it worthy to celebrate her birthday with the less privilege. As we are touching your lives, please touch other people's lives that you are better than. We want to encourage you to know that you are not alone. This birthday celebration is for you. It's not for me. I always said it. Even last year when we did our little dance here, I told you that we are going to continue. Even if it's one bag of rice we share, at least something was shared. And to God be the glory with the COVID-19 and all the stress that happened this year. Many people died. And look that we are still here alive. It's something to be grateful to God. It was a moment of great happiness for these special citizens as they wined, dined, and danced with their host, the woman with a golden heart. <laughs> Oh, the 
side Two white horses sitting side by side And these souls have gone Let me ride to one of these mornings Bright and early I'm going home to be on the side of trees Between the tears of it Let me ride of good health and long life was shared as well as cake of love and prosperity was cut by the woman of grace pharmacist Dimebi Leone Nodimije in the presence of her guests I'm going to cut this cake in a name that has secured this family See. in a name that has preserved the celebrant one time in a Indeed. name that is the foundation of this foundation eh? in a name that has preserved all nigerians through thick and thin That's so ladies and gentlemen i'm talking about the name and the color of it every knee bows amen that is the name of jesus Simple. we're going to spell the name of jesus and at the color of the last alphabet alphabet s we we'll cut the kick are we ready at the count of three i want everybody to tag along are we ready one two three let's go J, J, E, S, S U, S U, S U, One time. One time. Let's go. The saxophone is. Let's go now. Let's go now. Like a shining light that can never be hidden, the beneficiaries of her kind gesture, friends and family members, eulogize the Amazon of beauty, pharmacist Dimebi Loni Nodimiji. I'm very happy. I'm very, very grateful. I cannot even express my feelings. I like to be with this, my sister. My sister can do and undo. My sister, I'm very happy. 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 I'm very happy
I don't even know how to express my feelings. I don't know how to express my feelings. I am too proud. The woman has done great things that we didn't expect in our community because we have our community. That is the special citizen. We have our community. Some people have the money, but they can't even help us. See the kind of palliative she gave to us. I said, may God bless her abundantly in Jesus' name. It treats my heart so much about such wisdom, what I brought up this. So I thank God earnestly for giving us a daughter of this nature who can be able to recognize, at least jubilate, we rejoice in the presence of God. It's not easy for her to carry the vision that her mother left behind. You understand, there are some, they won't have the opportunity to move this vision forward, but she took a bold step to make sure that this, the candle does not go off. So a whole lot to celebrate, a whole lot to congratulate her, and I say more grace to her help. I wish her the best, I wish her long life, good health, I wish her more grace. She's a strong woman, and I know the hand of the Lord is upon her. And I believe definitely she will get where she's going. It's a good thing and it is worthy of note that when a mother or a father starts a good thing, it is encouraging that the, the offspring continues it. She's been like a mother figure to all of us, especially after our parents passed away. And she's always been this way. She's kind-hearted, she's caring, she's there, she's genuine. I mean, I was, first thing I would wish her is life. Because as you see... The, Life is, is everything. If you are alive, you can do this, you can do many more, you can do anything at all. So I want her to have long life. That is the first thing I wish her. And the second thing I wish her is happiness. And I wish that she gets everything she's praying for. You do this because somehow it makes you want to know more about people that are less privileged, people that are blind, people that are crippled and the rest of them. And celebrating with the orphans too makes us understand how it feels to be an orphan because we are orphans too. So um, it just makes me feel like I'm at home because I'm with people that I can actually associate with. I can actually, you know, say, okay, we are we are in this together. Her personality is something that you cannot just quantify. It's, she has different personalities for different occasions. So I'm really, I'm going to say she's like a, a superwoman. She's a tropical of her mom, carbon copy of her. Caught in everything, action, behavior, everything. There's nothing more than uh, recognizing those that uh, uh, cannot be able to uh, recognize you. Uh, being a father to those that cannot father you, being a mother to those that cannot mother you. I mean, uh, this is what life is all about as far as I'm concerned. That's the only way you can measure success, you know, in life. No, it, 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 this is quite encouraging and I think others should uh, emulate uh, this kind of virtues. This is what uh, we measure value. That God will continue to empower her. God will continue to give her that uh, special kind of feeling. Because the the truth is that you don't give because you have. You you give because you you care. Many Nadimi believes in the words of Maitama Gandhi: "Be the change you want to see in the world." This foundation is to you know, continue the good works that our late mother and our late father we are doing while they are on this earth and we are using it to touch people's life and also to immortalize their name and to make people to know that it's still good to do good things even after you're gone, your legacy lives on. This particular exercise has been something that we have been doing for a long time and um, it's part of us now, it's part of myself and my family. It's actually an inbuilt um, plan and imbued dedication of service to humanity. So it's something that has been spawned out of emotions and making sure that we try to make any group that has physically challenged disability, making sure that they are partaking one way or the other so they don't feel left out. Whether you're a, you're a cripple or you are blind or you're deaf or you're a widow or you are often like myself. You are not left out. So right now, this is not an, a governmental uh, agency. It's a non-profit organization where we are just using our little proceeds from our businesses 
to go back and you know touch people's life more of like a humanitarian service so this is my little way of reaching back to the society thanking god for what he has done for me reaching back to those that don't have enough being a woman with high business acumen Pharmacist Zimebilione Nodimije is a managing director, Regan Remedies Limited, a pharmaceutical company for drugs production. She is the chief executive officer, Udera Pharmaceutical Atlas, and all everyday supermarkets and some in Bapuekago airports or in Imo State. She is a member of Pharmaceutical Council of Nigeria. Member Association of Community Pharmacists of Nigeria Member Red Cross Society of Nigeria Member Geosciences Club Member International Pharmacy Students Member African Pharmaceutical Industrial Professionals Network Member International Society for Pharmacoeconomics and Outcomes Research Member International Christians Medical Association Member Orede Chamber of Commerce, Industry and Mines and Council Member Manufacturers Association of Nigeria Pharmacist Dumobi Loni Nodimije has demonstrated that happiness is not necessary derived by what we get but rather by what we give this is why she deemed it fit to celebrate her birthday with the less privilege and that's her our heartland star of today's episode my name is Asomta Obidaso hope you enjoyed every bit of this program goodbye